The Wuchung Mountains are a group of three long low ridges of volcanic origin, between 400 and 500 feet high, lying parallel to each other in northern New Jersey and the United States. The Wuchung Mountains are known for their numerous scenic vistas overlooking New York City, Newark and New Jersey skylines as well as their isolated ecosystems containing rare plants, endangered wildlife, rich minerals, and globally imperiled trap rock glade communities. The ridges traditionally contained the westward spread of urbanization, forming a significant geologic barrier beyond the Piedmont west of the Hudson River. The town of Newark, for example, once included lands from the Hudson to the base of the mountains. Later treaties moved the boundary to the top of the mountain, to include the springs. The Wuchungs are basalt uplifts, geologically similar to the Palisades along the Hudson River. In many places, however, the mountains have become sinuous islands of natural landscape within the suburban sprawl covering much of contemporary northeastern New Jersey. Parks, preserves, and numerous historical sites dot the valleys and slopes of the mountains, providing recreational and cultural activities to one of the most densely populated regions of the nation. Geography The two most prominent ridges, known as First Wuchung Mountain and Second Wuchung Mountain, stretch for over 40 miles from Somerville in the southwest through Morris County, Union County, Essex County and Passaic County to Mawa in the northeast. The less prominent and discontinuous ridge formed by Long Hill, Riker Hill, Hook Mountain, and Pakanak Mountain is sometimes referred to as Third Wuchung Mountain and lies on the northwestern side of Second Wuchung Mountain. It should be noted that the entireties of First Wuchung Mountain and Second Wuchung Mountain are often erroneously referred to as Orange Mountain and Preakness Mountain. Historically, the names Orange and Preakness have only been applied to specific sections of these ridges. The confusion appears to have arisen from the fact that First Wuchung Mountain is said to be composed of Orange Mountain basalt, while Second Wuchung Mountain is composed of Preakness Mountain basalt. The names applied to the basalts are actually geologic type localities, that is to say, the type of rock found at Orange Mountain is exclusive to all of First Wuchung Mountain, while the type of rock found at Preakness Mountain is exclusive to all of Second Wuchung Mountain. Like First and Second Wuchung Mountain, Third Wuchung Mountain is sometimes confused with its type locality, as its entire length is erroneously referred to as Hook Mountain on some occasions. In addition to the three main ridges of the Wuchungs, a smaller fourth ridge exists south of Morristown and west of Third Wuchung Mountain. While attaining elevations over 400 feet above sea level, the ridge lacks topographic prominence, only rising to about 100 feet above the surrounding terrain. Only one portion of the ridge is named a southern section underlying Harding Township known as Lee's Hill. All of the ridges lie to the east of the higher Appalachian Mountains, which in northern New Jersey are often referred to as the New York, New Jersey Highlands. Together with the Appalachian Mountains to the west, the Wuchungs Pen in an area formerly occupied by the prehistoric glacial Lake Passaic. The Great Swamp, a large portion of which is designated as the Great Swamp National Wildlife Refuge, is a remnant of this lake, presently retained by Third Wuchung Mountain. Although the Wuchungs commonly are described in terms of their east-west ridge arrangement, they also are divided into smaller mountain ranges, as well as various named ridges. Following is a list describing the notable ranges and ridges of the Wuchungs from north to south. Camp Gore Mountain is the northernmost ridge of the Wuchungs, formed by a combination of first and second Wuchung Mountain. Its northern terminus is the Ramapo Mountains, near the New York border. A shallow gap separates its southern end from Preakness Mountain and Gofflin Hill. Preakness Mountain comprises part of the northern extent of Second Wuchung Mountain between the Passaic River and Camp Gore Mountain. Along with Pakanak Mountain to the west, Preakness Mountain forms the Preakness Range. The three highest peaks of the Wuchungs are located in this range. 
Gothla Hill, part of First Warchung Mountain, flanks the eastern side of Preakness Mountain. Its northern end is broken by a shallow gap separating it from Camp Gore Mountain, while its southern end is divided from Garrett Mountain by the Passaic River in Patterson. Third Warchung Mountain begins with Pakanak Mountain, part of the Preakness Range. The Pompton River separates the south end of Parkarnak from the beginning of Tawako Mountain or Hook Mountain, which runs west-northwest and then turns south to form a curve encircling the Great Peace Meadows along the Passaic River, ending near Pine Brook. To the south, the Rockaway, Whippany, and Passaic Rivers flow east through a gap in the range, which resumes south of Beaufort. New Jersey as Riker Hill. The Passaic flows west through another gap north of Chatham, below which Long Hill stretches southwest and then west to Millington, where the Passaic drains the Great Swamp and cuts through the range. Third Warchung extends a short distance west of Millington to Liberty Corner, with a spur, Cedar Hill, jutting northeast at Lyons. The Newark Mountains are a historical range, encompassing the ridges of 1st and 2nd Warchung Mountain south of the Passaic River. 1st Warchung Mountain in this range begins in the north as Garrett Mountain. South of Garrett Mountain is Orange Mountain, which is separated from Garrett Mountain by a gap known as the Great Notch. The Hobart Gap, near Springfield, then divides Orange Mountain from the remaining southern part of 1st Warchung Mountain, which stretches south and then west before terminating near Far Hills. 2nd Warchung Mountain begins in the north of the Newark Mountains as what is historically known as Caldwell Mountain. The northern terminus of Caldwell Mountain is the Passaic River, while the southern terminus is at the Hobart, Milburn Gap. South of the Gap, 2nd Warchung Mountain parallels 1st Warchung Mountain to Far Hills. There, a gap known as Moggy Hollow incises the ridge before it makes a turn to the north. The remaining section of 2nd Warchung Mountain, known as Pill Hill, then continues a short distance before terminating along the Ramapo Mountains. Noteworthy summits of the Warchungs include High Mountain, Beach Mountain, and Mount Chechino in Wayne, which stand at 879 feet, 869 feet and 755 feet above sea level. Another notable summit is the hilltop in Verona, Cedar Grove, and North Caldwell, which peaks at 675 feet just east of the water sphere. History the original inhabitants of the Warchungs, the Lenape, referred to the mountains as the Varkunks, or High Hills. Evidence of the Lenape presence in the Warchungs can be seen in numerous camp sites that have been uncovered, mainly along the rivers coursing through mountains and in the small caves abundant in the volcanic rock. It is thought the Lenape favored the Warchungs for their profusion of natural resources, including abundant freshwater rivers and streams, a variety of forests, and plentiful fish and game. The Lenape Trail goes along the edge of the cliffs, and used the overlooks there as smoke signal locations. They also took advantage of the rich soils and maintained many farm areas where they raised a variety of seasonal crops. With the arrival of Europeans, the same resources that sustained the indigenous peoples served settlers, trade in furs to European markets, a bounty of game and fish, and native garden produce for the traders was important during the Dutch colonial period when few settlements occurred. Perhaps most importantly with the settlements established during the English colonial period, the rivers and streams of the Warchungs also supported grain, grist, and sawmills. Later, the energy of these rivers would be harnessed for industry, most notably at the Great Falls of the Passaic River, where mechanical and hydroelectric systems exploited the energy of water falling over the face of First Warchung Mountain. Outside of providing gradation to rivers and streams, the height of the Warchungs has proven useful for other reasons. In the French and Indian War, the military reused the Lenape signal points, as did Washington later. During the Revolutionary War, General George Washington used the protection of the Warchung Mountains to erect the first and second Middlebrook encampment. 
This position on the high ground also allowed him to monitor the area between Perth Amboy and New Brunswick as well as to identify and disturb British movements between Manhattan and Philadelphia. During the Revolution the signaling beacons along the Warchungs were extended far up the Hudson and to Boston. In the 20th century, the hilltop in Verona, the highest point in Essex County, served as the site of a sanatorium for tuberculosis patients. The county hospital was built there because the high elevation provided clean, mountain air away from the cities to the east. At the height of the Cold War, Camp Gore Mountain was selected to house an Ike missile base. Installed on the mountain between 1955 and 1971, the base's missile served to guard New York City airspace, standing by to intercept nuclear-armed Soviet bombers. The facility ultimately was abandoned with the advent of intercontinental ballistic missiles. Two other missile sites were nestled into the forests atop peaks in Mountainside and Morris Township, creating a triangle of redundant sites. Geology. 200 million years ago, magma intruded into the Newark Basin, then an active rift basin associated with the breakup of the supercontinent Pangaea. The magma was initially contained within the sedimentary strata of the basin, forming large intrusions like the Palisades Sill, but it ultimately broke out to the surface through large, episodic eruptions. The Warchung Mountains were originally formed from these eruptions consisting of three separate flood basalts that may have filled nearly the entire Newark Basin. Each time the basin filled with basalt, which cooled into blocky trap rock, a period of limited volcanic activity followed, allowing sediment to be deposited on top of the previously erupted layer of basalt. In this way, the Newark Basin became layered with alternating strata of Warchung basalt and Jurassic sedimentary rock. Throughout the early Jurassic, the Newark Basin underwent extensive dipping and folding. The western side of the basin plunged deeper into the crust, tilting the basin's strata to an angle of between 5 and 25 degrees. Localized deformation of the western edge of the basin along the Ramapo Fault system formed alternating synclines and anticlines that warped the layers of basalt and sedimentary rock. Erosion began to attack the basin as rifting failed and deposition of new sediments ceased. Over millions of years, erosion ate downward through the tilted rock of the basin, eventually encountering the basalt layers, which are significantly more erosion-resistant than the surrounding sedimentary rock. The result of this has been that the exposed edges of the eroding basalt layers have managed to persist longer than the exposed edges of the sedimentary layers, causing them to project prominently above the surrounding surface terrain as high ridges. Today, the flood basalts are preserved in the synclines adjacent to the Ramapo fault system. It is in these synclines that the basalt layers are thick and warped into downward dipping trap rock sheets descending below the current erosional surface of the basin. Notably, the synclines preserve not only the basalt layers but also some overlying Jurassic sedimentary rock. The largest syncline in the basin, the Warchung syncline, contains the greater portion of the Warchung flood basalts as they appear today. The projecting, eroding edges of the flood basalts preserved in the syncline form the three ridges of the Warchung Mountains. Jurassic sedimentary rock layers between and above the ridges form the Feltville, Toaco and Boonton formations. Elsewhere in the Newark Basin, smaller synclines preserve the Warchung outliers. Additional fragments of the flood basalt and associated overlying sediments that have survived into the modern era. Because the majority of the Warchung mountains are composed of extrusive igneous trap rock. They display characteristic columnar jointing and stack lava flows. These features are readily noted along the eastern faces of the ridges, which often present mural precipices or vertical escarpments. Similar features can also be seen in the Palisades Sill, although these were formed within the Earth's crust. Additionally, the Warchungs feature not only blocky AA lava, but also ropey and billowing Paho Aho flows. 
The magma which generated the Warchungs and the Palisades also formed the intrusive igneous Sauerland Mountain in central New Jersey, as well as a series of smaller outlying volcanic ridges in the region. Kushetunk Mountain, a ring-shaped volcanic mountain between Sauerland Mountain and the Warchungs, is of the same geologic lineage. The Metacomet Mountains in the Connecticut River Basin, another aborted rift valley, came into existence around the same time as the Warchungs, also through extrusive eruptions. While non-contiguous, the two ranges may be considered geologic cousins, having formed under similar circumstances during the rifting of Pangaea. The same erosive and tectonic forces which elevated the Warchungs also served to raise the Metacoma. Mineralogy The Warchungs are composed principally of volcanic basalt, which historically has been used in railroad beds and road construction. In addition to this, in many places the mountains are underlain by red and white sandstone which has at times been used in building construction. Mica and calcareous spar often accompany these sandstone beds. Due to the volcanic nature of the Warchungs, zeolites, including prenite, enalcimers, and stilbite, which form from a reaction of mafic rocks in alkaline environments, can be found along exposed ridgelines. Agate, primarily in the form of chalcedony and crystalline quartz, are prominent in the ancient lava flows of the Warchungs and are typically seen as embedded nodules along exposed fronts. Datolite, another nodular mineral, has been found embedded in the volcanic rock around the Great Falls. Additionally, Jasper and Saturn Spa are known to exist within the northwestern Preakness Range. Copper also can be found in the Warchungs. Near Belleville, ore containing 8% copper was discovered, and a copper mine once operated in the area. Other copper-bearing ores have been noted near Patterson. These ores typically contain cuprite and or copper carbonate in a matrix of red or grey sandstone. Pyritus copper, also known as chalk copyright, is not known to exist in ores found in the Warchungs. Conservation In the mid-20th century, the ability of the Warchungs to hold back the spread of urbanization was greatly reduced with the development of the interstate highway system. Three interstate highways, I-80, I-280, and I-78, were sliced through the Warchungs, allowing suburbia to invade its inner valleys and slopes. Near the end of the century, I-287, a great semicircular beltway enclosed the Warchungs within the bulge of suburbia radiating out from New York City. Many pathways of safe passage through the mountains, retained from the time of the Lenapes, were severed and blocked by the highways. Today, along the summits of the Warchungs, Taylor's slope environs as well as globally rare trap rock glade outcrop communities and their unique species have become threatened by development. As a response, efforts to conserve the unique landscapes of the Warchungs have been undertaken. The largest of the conservation efforts so far is High Mountain Park Preserve, which at 1,153.7 acres sets aside one of the largest tracts of wilderness in the New Jersey Piedmont. The park is known to contain at least one globally imperiled plant, Tories Mountain Mint, as well as three other plants endangered within New Jersey. Other large areas of preserved land lie within the valleys of the Warchungs. The Great Swamp National Wildlife Refuge, retained within the embrace of Third Warchung Mountain, now consists of 7,600 acres or almost 12 square miles of arid habitats. The refuge was created through the efforts and donations of a small group of local residents in 1959, the Jersey Jet Port Site Association, and a Great Swamp Committee later formed within the North American Wildlife Foundation. It is championed by many organizations among the contemporary communities adjacent to the refuge. The Great Swamp, as well as other swamps retained by the Warchungs, including Great Peace Meadows, constitute the remains of glacial Lake Passaic. The lake existed during the last Ice Age, eventually draining as a glacier in the northern Warchungs receded and allowed the lake's water to empty out via a gap in the ridges of Thurston. 
Second Wuchung Mountain currently occupied by the Passaic River. General awareness of the history and natural environment of Wuchungs has been increased through efforts such as the construction and designation of the Lenape Trail. The trail traverses rugged sections of the mountains while at the same time connecting various historical sites pertinent to the history of New Jersey. Recreation Parks and reservations from north to south Camp Gore Mountain Reservation, Camp Gore Mountain, Franklin Lakes Nature Preserve, Gofflin Hill, High Mountain Park Preserve, Preakness Range, Great Falls State Park under development, First Wuchung Mountain, Garrett Mountain Reservation, First Wuchung Mountain, Rifle Camp Park, First Wuchung Mountain, Mills Reservation, First Wuchung Mountain, Hilltop Reservation, 2nd Wuchung Mountain, Eagle Rock Reservation, 1st Wuchung Mountain, Riker Hill Park, Riker Hill, Len A Trail, 1st, 2nd, and 3rd Wuchung Mountain, South Mountain Reservation, 1st and 2nd Wuchung Mountain, Wuchung Reservation, 1st and 2nd Wuchung Mountain, Washington Rock State Park, 1st Wuchung Mountain, Washington Valley Park, 1st Wuchung Mountain, Leonard J. Buck Garden, Moggy Hollow Natural Area, 2nd Wuchung Mountain, Image Gallery, Cliff Face on 1st Wuchung Mountain displaying jointed columns of stacked basalt, Washington Rock in Greenbrook Township, New Jersey. Geology typical of the Wuchung Range, view of Manhattan from 1st Wuchung Mountain, the backside of the Palisades seen from 1st Wuchung Mountain approximately 13 miles away.